Ostara or the spring equinox means fertility is afoot. And that means the earth and its creatures are coming alive again and getting energized. To take advantage of the springtime friskiness in the air, I'm sharing three ways we can use flowers in magic for some flower magic. First, find yourself a bouquet of daffodils. You can use jonquils or any kind of narcissus. These vibrant beings are some of the first springtime creatures that pop up. Bringing them into a room will immediately bring energy into it, and this is especially good to put in a room where someone is ill or depressed. Once the flowers have wilted, collect the dried petals to use in a spell for resilience. So you'll need a taper candle, dried crushed daffodil flowers, a tag lock, which could be hair, body fluid, photograph, signature. A tag lock is something that is intimate and personal from somebody else or somewhere else. And you use this to create a bridge. Sunflower or olive oil. And then you're gonna dress your candle with your oil or if you wanna use your saliva. You're gonna take your tag lock and add it to your daffodil mix. So you can either snip up a hair or a signature, that photograph, whatever it is, and add it to the daffodils. If you're using body fluids, you can put a couple drops within that mixture as well. And then roll it in your flower mix and place the candle where your bouquet was. Daffodils are poisonous, so do not ingest them and don't let your animals do it either. Here is an easy twist on your protection and cleansing salt. Combine your rose petals with your salt and set it out to dry for a week. You can use this in your circle, in a bath, to cleanse tools, and even in some kitchen witchery like salads, fruit, ice cream, or even cocktails. And you can add rose thorns to where appropriate. And I would recommend not getting your roses from a flower shop, but either grow them yourself or get food grade rose petals. And then you can add flower magic to a money drawing oil. For this, you'll need basil for money, mint for wealth, chamomile for prosperity, nasturtium for easy manifestation, cinnamon for speed. You're gonna cover your herbs in olive oil and then let them sit in a window for a moon cycle. And then strain out the herbs and use them to anoint a candle, money, a charm, a register, or a wallet. If you have any other suggestions for some flower magic this spring, leave them in the comments below. See you later. <laughs>